Hi everybody, I'm apologizing for the sound up front. I haven't linked my external mic yet. And this is a very reflective surface in this particular studio that I'm in. Uh, everything is reflective, uh, the desktop's reflective. So I'm gonna get right into it. We're looking uh, for these missing clips. Um, so uh, this is these are not video clips, they're audio clips, uh, sound effects for a film that we're making called How to Disappear and Never Get Found. Now. The issue here is that these sound effects have not come from an external drive. They've actually come on board from an onboard um, sound effects uh, folders, Final Cut Pro sound effects. And in my previous video, I was struggling to find iMovie. Uh, I was struggling to find iLife, the iLife sound effects, which is the one that I could not find. Well, it turns out that the iLife sound effects are actually all found inside iMovie. Okay, that's where Apple has moved everything into, which kind of makes sense. It's sort of intuitive that it would be in iMovie, but of course, it's a little unusual that iMovie is not the top folder, but then again, you could also switch the order of the folders. Okay, so how do we find these clips? How do we find these clips? So one of the things that we need to do first is keep your finger on the command button, otherwise you're going to lose all that setting. And um, you're going to basically go into any folder. You're going to go into your uh, applications. Okay, so you're going to go into applications. And once you're in applications, uh, what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to go into uh, iMovie. Just click on iMovie, and then once you're on iMovie, um, once you're on iMovie, do a show package contents. So Right-click on it and show package contents. So you go to contents, you open contents, you go into resources, and inside resources you should see all the sound effects, and then they are iLife sound effects, iMovie sound effects, iMovie theme music. So the sound effects are all there, and I like sound effects, which you could not find anywhere else. Certainly not as a standalone application, is inside the resources folder of iMovie. So that's where it is at the moment. Um, now, hmm, the trick, of course, is that we somehow need to move the iLife sound effects uh, into a place that kind of makes sense. Now. I can show you how to do it, but you're going to realize that the big problem, of course, is that you can't locate it from the inside. I'll show you what I mean. So you go to file, you relink the files. Okay, there are the files. You make sure it's all all, and you go locate it. And you go into, um, you go into uh, iMovie. There it is. And now iMovie will do a scan and you should be able to find them. However, for some obscure reason, even though it's going through all of the folders inside iMovie, it's not going to find the sound effects. And you'll see what I mean now. Okay, it won't find it. It says there, select another folder. None of the six files are found in this folder. None. What you're about to do is very scary and you have to be very sure that you know what you're doing. So. Here we go. I'm going to pull the iLife sound effects out. Okay. So can you see what that is? Is I'm not. I haven't pulled the folder out, but I've pulled a shortcut to it. So what I'm now going to do, because now it's in the. Remember, it's only a shortcut, so it doesn't matter. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to locate selected, and this time I'm going to go to desktop. And in desktop. I'm going to look up iLife, which is my shortcut. And now I'm going to basically um, select each one individually. And it should, it should find the sound effects. You see it's actually doing a very quick search. And it should find the sound effects. If it doesn't, that's fine. Big R, it didn't. So we're going to have to try a different approach to finding these sound effects. But at least now we know for sure that they're not inside iLife sound effects. Now that sounds kind of weird because you're thinking, well, we kind of knew that because we were inside iMovie. Yeah, and iMovie was going through all of the uh, 
the search was going into the resources folder which had the iLife sound effects. Well, turns out that's not really true. That's not true at all um, because apparently even though it searches, there are instances where it actually doesn't search into um, the iLife uh, folder as I've read online. So let's leave it at that and I will give you another tutorial showing you where to find these clips. Thank you so much for watching.